Yeah, right, so in Jero here, um, I'm just doing a short clip, um, just me using the Hoonigan um, FC Hertz bomb on uh, Forza 7 with the G920 with uh, on 900 degrees. Uh, I built this car and it feels fucking quality with um, with 90 degrees on this wheel. For me, it does. It might be because of my driving style and my tune setup, but if if you want to try this tune, I will share it. At the moment, it's not shared, but I'm still kind of tweaking on it. So I'm just going to do a few runs, maybe two or three, just to show you how fucking smooth this car is on a G920 or 900. I'm on full lock here, near enough. Lift off, wheel spins exactly where I want it to. Maybe just a bit too much there, but I could have just come off the throttle a little bit more then to prevent that. So we're gonna go back down the hill in Dubai. It all matters about your line and your, your throttle input with it on this game, if, if I'm honest. So I'm just going to brake drift a bit here, tap the wall there. But I noticed with brake drifting is it really helps with keeping you nice and smooth with the 900 degrees, especially with this wheel, because sometimes it likes to twitch. But I, with this car, I think it's just because of the angle it has um, from Horizon 3, it just, I don't know what with me, I feel like it just works really well. It might be just because of my style or my setup, but I'm really liking this car at the moment. Right, I'll do one more run and then um, I think we're going to call it because I've got work tomorrow. <laughs> Handbrake is a bit difficult to get to, but because I've had this wheel for quite a while now, I just I'm getting used to where the handbrake button is every time. So when it spins, I know where to locate my hand. Um, I know with the TMX it can be a bit difficult because I tried it when I was at New York um, with the New York Invitational. Um, but as you can see, hopefully the footage will off my iPhone can can show that um, 9 degrees does work with this wheel it all depends on your, like I say, your foot control, your, your style of drifting and your setups the mine is quite, quite aggressive, as you can see I can just it, it, it's quite easy, it, this is like, from S15 it's the same I don't this is the way you want it, really. Just lift off and yeah, you know, cast it on the car. It's a bit like AC. Just you lift off and uh, the wheel does what it what does it for you, and you just catch it. Now uh, this this is nothing of my last last clip now. Well, last one, I mean.
so I'm just going to leave it there. Um, yeah, so I've just done a short video uh, of me drifting on Dubai with the Logitech G920 um, with 90 degrees. So hopefully, if you need any tips, just let me know. I haven't been getting com I haven't really been commenting back on my comments on YouTube lately, so I thought I'd do this video now and. Um, I can like watch it. Well, look at the look at the chat. Uh, look at the comments and reply back because I've been working lately and I've just I can't be bothered if I'm honest. So this is my latest car. And I'm f it's fucking amazing to me. I suppose this wheel nine hundred. It might be to the settings like I've said and all my driving style and all that. But yeah, uh, thanks for watching and yeah. Um, if you want to get in contact with me. Just hit me up on Steam or Renjiro or Xbox. Cheers.